What is it you aim to achieve? So we started the company to better educate everybody in the country, right? So a lot of lot of people already depend on us uh, to provide services for them. But eventually we figured that we can't be everywhere at the same time. So we're more focused on education right now so that we can equip everybody to do what they're supposed to do, right? Make their lives a lot easier so they don't have to call us in every time. The other thing that we've understood uh, by delivering a lot of trainings is that what people take back after the training is very little, right? You might be talking to them for three days, but their attention span might be, you know, half a day amongst all of that three days. So we really wanted to simplify things and break all of the training down into, you know, three-day workshops. And even in that workshop, what we tried to do is do one and a half days of theory and one and a half days of practical, so 50-50%. And what we figured out along the way is that when somebody does something hands-on, it becomes muscle memory and it stays with them forever. Right, rather than putting something on the board, and which definitely they're going to forget in the next couple of weeks. Absolutely, that combination of theoretical and kinesthetic approach is absolutely essential. Could you um, give our readers a bit of a highlight into the modules that you offer? So we start from the very fundamentals of what audio is, how audio is carried out, the fundamentals of electronics and the fundamentals of math behind uh, audio itself, right? And then we move down the signal chain to microphones, amplifiers, loudspeakers, and for the, then we branch out midway uh, into two segments. One is the design team, and the other one is the implementation team. Because every integrator has two different people working in the field, right? One person designs it, but it's not necessarily the same person who's going out to install it. Now, this is where the problem happens, right? Because if you design something wrong, then the guy who's implementing it has no idea how to do it because he has you know two sets of equipment that doesn't like don't talk to each other yeah, yeah yeah so we then split it halfway and then the design team goes into you know uh, wider subjects like uh, simulation how to get things right room acoustics and stuff like that so that they can prepare that design and do the perfect thing that's required for that venue right and for the implementation we go down to deeper aspects of you know how to program your DSP how to set your amplifiers how to set limiters for your speakers so you don't burn them out the right cables to use how to terminate those cables properly what kind of uh, crimping tools you need how to build your racks how to run power on a rack how to run signal on a rack how to differentiate so that you don't have any interference AV over IP and things like that these are all essential skills. We never stop learning this industry, so exactly, I can really yeah. see the value you're bringing a lot there. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.